What do you want? When just for the record, I'm all done with vampire demands for the day. Push me and see what happens. You don't want to see what happens. My family's in jeopardy, you're responsible. That's on you, man. If Tristan didn't have the pendant, then he wouldn't have any leverage over me. So she must have had a plan B. Perhaps they had assistance. Tell me, were you a part of it? Oh, come on, hey, man. back off, all right? Look, I trust Vincent. Look, I don't care if, I don't care if any of you trust me, to be perfectly honest, because unlike all of you, I have been doing something. Roger's up there, he's probably cutting a deal or killing somebody. Either way, we really ain't got nothing to talk about. Thank you. Now look, the only gratitude I need from any of you is seeing you leave the city. You are an infection on my city. You have absolutely no virtue and you have no value here or wherever it is that you decide to drag yourself next. I feel so sorry for that little girl that she's got to be raised in a household with a punk like you. And I'm going to be praying for her soul because I know you ain't got one. Thank you for helping my family. Besides your niece, I don't give a damn about you or anybody else in your family. I'm here right now because there's something that's hurting kids in my city. And the second that it is gone, I'm going to make sure that you're gone too. But you Michelsons are selfish, egocentric fanatics. It is not my job, nor is it my inclination to try to convince you to do the right thing. If you really want to save your niece, then you need to get out of my ear and let me do what it is that I do. You destroyed somebody good today in order to save people who've had more than their share of lifetimes. I know. I had to preserve my family. I couldn't just stop, Freya! You're just as much of a bloodsucker as the rest of them. You Michaelsons, you always find a way to get right back on top, don't you? Man, I bet you got a plan all figured out. As a matter of fact, they do. An alliance between you and I is essential. Apologies won't bring back what's been lost. Then shut up and let Vincent track down that witch. Where do you think you're going? I want to find her just as much as you do, but I cannot concentrate. Not with this pointless bickering. I've got a lot on my plate, Elijah, without whatever trouble you're trying to bring my way. You need me. And fortunately, I have a long history of removing anything undesirable from the war. I'm probably one of the things that's on your list, so I reckon it's best for me to work alone. Oh, it's not an offer. Children's lives are at risk. You care about children's lives at risk. What about Davina Claire, Elijah? So you can only see me as some kind of merciless butcher. Yes, I do. You witches always plead virtue, but if history is to be prologue, you're the most rotten of the bunch. As soon as Freya told me that Haley had gone missing, there were a dozen of us witches out there on them streets performing locator spells trying to find her. Haley, unlike you, has earned our respect. Over and over, it's the exact same story. I give that family the benefit of the doubt, I do magic for them, and then in the end, it's just the same thing. I warned you, Klaus. All the good people that you feasted on, all that innocent blood that you spilled. It's time you gave that back. What do you want? Marcel and I need your help. We know that it was a vampire who took Haley in with your magic. You must be out of your mind, Klaus. I'm not doing any magic for you. Matter of fact, I must be out of my mind because I thought you had it in you. I really thought that you had the potential to be a better man. But after this, all you know how to do is use and abuse. You treat us like we're pawns in your family's endless self-defeating schemes. But congratulations. You made it back to the top of the food chain. If you come after my witches again, it is going to be a war. And I don't mean a war between you and the covens. I mean a war between you and me. As long as they are sick and tired of the same old, same old that you and your pathetic family are always and forevering about. It's going to take something a hell of a lot stronger than an apology coffee for a Michelson family emergency. Klaus is in town. Now, I hate vampires. I hate Klaus Michelson more than any of them. And I'm willing to stand beside him against that thing that you call your master. Now that right there should show you just how bad your master actually is. I'm gonna take that as a compliment.